Amin. 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 Chief Imam, he begins by saying, Inna lillah wa inna ilayhi rajiun. Inna lillahi ma akhaza wa lahu ma akhaza. إن لله ما أخذ وله ما أعطى وكل شيء عنده بعجل مسمى وكل شيء عنده بعجل مسمى قال الله تعالى نعم تشمع مزمو أن تقول سماء سماء سبب القرآن ما جاءنا لبشر من قبلك الخلد نعم أفعل مدفه من خالدون نعم كل نفس ذائقة الموت نعم الله جك أنت Chief Imam says that on the subject of your visit is that he's praying that may Allah have compassion and mercy on his de de departed spouse. Amen. Um, information reaching me indicates that uh, you have also been bereaved, uh, Amir. So therefore, we'll include all of both of them in our prayer. So we will salatu ala nabi. اللهم صل على محمد الفاتح الحق الناس الحق الحق ولا يدين الصور لكم المستقيم ولا أليها قدر من كتابه العظيم. آمين. قل هو الله ثري and then one آية الكرسي بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله أحد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا أحد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله أحد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا أحد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل هو الله أحد الله الصمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفوا أحد الله لا إله إلا هو الحي القيوم لا تأخذه سنة ولا نوم له ما في السماوات ما في الأرض من ذا الذي يشفع عنده إلا بإذنه يعلم ما بين عيدهم وما خلفهم ولا يحيطون بشأن مدمه إلا بما شاع واسع كرسيه السماوات والأرض ولا يعوده حفظهما وهو العلي العظيم All these verses of the Quran the holy text that we have recited may its blessings reach our departed May Allah reach the reward must reach them and uh, all of us may Allah give us the blessings and the, the reward for our patience and fortitude Fatiha Bismillahi Rahman Rahim Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim Malik Yawm Al-Din Iyaka Na'abul Wa Iyaka Nasta'in Ihdina Surat Al-Mustaqim Surat Al-Ladhin Anamta Alayhim Ghayr Al-Maghdubi Alayhim Wa Al-Dhalin Ameen On my own behalf On behalf of the eminent national chief Imam Amir and the delegation, we want to welcome you uh, this very bright morning. We are still in the season of our festivity. Uh, you have come with this great call. We are grateful to you. And also to welcome you also uh, for, for coming at this time. Your, your reverence, your courtesies, your, your respect, your love, as you have been expressed, is something well noted. And uh, we want to keep it on, on, on record. Uh, we also know that whenever such a meeting takes place, there must be a reason. Uh, and by way of Amani, uh, even when we know, uh, we'll behave, behave as we do not know. And uh, we will ask uh, why you have decided to come to your dad uh, this very auspicious uh, moment. Uh, if by way of our Amani, uh, <clears throat> you are under threat, like we know in our traditional wisdom, and so that we keep you safe before anybody attacks you. Uh, and Chief Imam has, uh, especially Amir, you, you are very dear to Chief Imam, so he will make sure you are well protected. But there are some, some rooms are, are here. <laughs> uh, but as usual, you have come on a note of love, respect. Uh, we are, this time that we are in, uh, we are grateful that you are, you are here. By word of introduction, uh, your very good friend is here, Elijah Latif Abdul Salam, with the uh, protocol to the Chief Imam. Uh, Sadiq Zanwa is here as the secretary to the advisory board. Um, those that you see behind here, uh, they are very, very important people. I call them the in-chamber uh, servants of the chief imam and make sure he's comfortable. And so they play a very significant role and we appreciate them for, uh, for that. Uh, I'm the least of them here, so I also speak for the chief, for the chief imam. Uh, I want to stop here and then allow, I don't know who is going to be the spokesperson to take over. Uh, from us and tell Chief Imam why, why you have decided to, to come to him uh, around this time. So, what are you going to do? I want to look at you. Like you intimated, we are here on a very peaceful 
note kuma inda malam muka nuna wato zuwa wannan ziyartar namu dai wato ziyarta ne na zaman lafiya da kauna the sorrowful aspect of our visit has been diffused by the encouragement our father has given us this morning malam na karfa na biyu wato bacin ciki bacin ran da muka zo da shi game da wanga wanga ziyarta wato addu'an da ka riga kai ne she she kore ya shafe wannan bakin cikin at the time the sad event occurred uh, the national chief imam as we all know has brought all of us together as one big family cin lokacin da wanga abin nan ya faru to malam jama ya riga ya karga ka jawo mu gaba daya mu duka mabambanta aqida daban-daban ka kama wuri daya muka zama muna hadin kai so it was the collective responsibility of the whole family to have been here to see to it that our beloved mother was given the befitting burial that she deserved aka hakan nan wajibi ne da ake kowane kusuwa da zaman lokacin da aka yi rasuwar nan kowane kusuwa ya zama ka ya zo kuma yayi tarayya a cikin shirye-shiryen episode da za a yi but as you already were aware ami himself was out of town he himself was bereaved and many other things so naturally it was practically impossible for him to be ya musadafa kuma da lokacin da wannan ya abukun amir da kansa kuma shi ma sai shi ma ya samu irin nasa makoki saboda hakan nan sai da kuma ba shi magari balle ma ya iya shi ma ya sheko yazo but as Allah will have it the rest of the family who were at home at the occurrence of our dear mother's demise they stood for and on behalf of all of us and ensure that it was given the deserving burial that she deserved amma kan yanda Allah ya so ko da ke mu ba ba mu ba mu nan lokacin amma matsayin fardal kifaya wato sauran jama'a da ke nan duka shi suka tsaya a matsayin mu suka yi abin da ya kamata so it was our it is our responsibility therefore to come home and meet the family to at least express our gratitude to them for standing in for all of us and undertaking to see to the burial of our mother for and on behalf of all of us so i can then tunda an ga an yan kare wato mafi cancanta ne mu sheko mu zo mu ma mu nuna yabon mu ga wadanda sun ka tsaya a matsayin mu an kai an kai wato biso wannan daga cikin abin da ya samu ka zo and also to know what are the outstanding issues what can we also do to help to have all our standing issues resolved sannan kuma mu samu wani masaniya game da wani irin shirye-shirye ne ake yi kuma wani irin namu gudunmu wane mu ma yi kamata mu ma mu zo mu nuna saboda mu taimaka na lokaci addu'a ya kai zama an yi shi kuma akan tsari akan kuma yanayi mafi kamata secondly we all know that when death of this nature occurs even though we are family but some members of the family are affected more than others eh malam idan musiba duka ya faru kamar misali rasuwa ina taba mu duka da sassa daban-daban da amma akwai majibin talamari wannan su ne abin ke taba su sosai so our father having lived with our mother for many years as his wife obviously he would be the most affected one eh wato kai matsayin walidin mu da yake kai kai zama da ita lokaci mai tsawo babu shakka kai ne farko wanda wannan rasuwa zai taba it is our responsibility therefore the rest of us to come and also pray join hands to pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will strengthen him grant him the fortitude to be able to bear the the, the loss the pain haka haka nan wajibi ne mu mu sheko mu zo mu kusa da kai mu taba maka fada mu sanya maka zuciya mu maka ta'ziya mu kara karfa mu samu karfa faka a cikin wannan hali da kake ciki and also to assure him that even though our mother has left but we are still around to offer him every support that he requires samu baka kauna kuma da fika ga zuciyanka cewa ko da ke Allah ya dauki ta tafi ba kai kadai kake nan ba mu ma ƴaƴan kan nan muna nan muna nan tare da kai a cikin wannan kowane irin yanayi thirdly and finally and of course most importantly we are here to join hands with the rest of the family to pray to the almighty Allah beseech him to admit our dear mother into his bosom and to grant him jannah to fill down a karshe kuma shine mu samu dai zuwa wannan wannan lokacin mu hada hannu gaba daya a zuciya daya mu roke Allah Allah ya kara mata rahama ya kara mata jinkai kuma ya sata ya cikin makwanci mai kyau shine aljanna so these were the reasons why the our ahmedia muslim mission has delegated the very top hierarchy the national executives and the leadership of our wings owing organization led by no less a person than the amir and missionary him uh, in charge himself who happens to be a beloved son of our dear father to come and console him and also to commiserate with him and the family at large wala akan wannan dalilan ne da wasun su da yasa abin ga abin ga firkan ahmadiyya sun ga tara tawaga mai nauyi kaman irin wannan a zuwa ka maka wannan ziyarta ga kashin jagorancin shi da kan shugaban da kansa amir mulvi muhammad bin saleh so on this note i will say assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh wa alaikum assalam alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh amir wa khafif ibrahim but but amir i i hear on 
what, what is today's day? today? Today is Saturday. 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 Yes. I hear on Saturdays, but you speak Hausa very well. But there is always somebody who is a professor in Hausa. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot call our visit a, a very happy one. Malang, wonga irin ziyarta mazanchi ziyarta ni nafarin chiki ba. But at the same time, considering the festivities we've just gone through, the Eid al-Fitr festivities, mm. we are in duty bound as a family to come to extend our Eid al-Mubarak to our father. Tarik dah kerana malam ini kita mula cikin loka cikin ini nekuma wah jadi mula nekuma mahu isu dekai suah kuma nafarin cikin dekai kau na gamet dah bersalang ini dah mungkai. The Eid certainly is an occasion of happiness and gratitude to the Almighty Allah. Babu syaka loka cikin isu ini de waktu loka cikin nafarin cikin dekai kuma goria ga Allah subhanahu wa taala. On our part, therefore, it's an occasion for celebrating with our father. And uh, gratitude to Almighty Allah and gratitude to our Father who. Some lokachi ne zamu itariya da kai malang awan lokachi mono na farinci ke mo kawan lokachi mono godiyam mo taro kai taro kai kawan deke zamu mas ayim wali di gawur gareyam. But the real purpose for our coming today is what the General Secretary has already spelled out, and which is to commiserate with our Father. Ama hakik anin anin dalilin wana ziyarta de hakik anin sa toshi na abenda babamar buchi. Ya Yanuna Wadashine Mumala Muzo Mukama Kataziya Gameda Rashida Monkai. When I call him my father and we call him our father, it's something that is coming from the deeper recesses of our hearts and not just a mere word of mouth. Malan is a nakireka, a much aying a kokuma sefataka, a much aying ubako walidi, walidi kubaga kaina kareba. Ama gamu tu gabar emu gamar emu nang kata makan ada mas ayung uba uba gak garemu muna fadi hak ane tsanza naga kasih yang suka temu. It is we the children who are in a position to quantify what filial love a father has given to us. Our father himself may not be in a position to even quantify it, but we do, and that is what it's supposed to be, and we know how much we revere him for that filial love that he has provided us throughout these years. Not just me alone, not just Ahmadi Muslims alone, but the Muslim community of Ghana and Ghana as a nation. I'm not saying that I am 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 not saying Kabar wa amamu ni muka samu wa nang iru wajib tunka dah hilman dekai mana na muka iya muki manta muka gazuci amu muka iru abend da abend dekai mana akasa gabaki da. I believe in Ghana today as we find ourselves, even we those who believe that we are the first line members of his family, there are others out there who are not Muslims, but they are Ghanaians who challenge us and would want us to believe that. You are more a father to them than you are even to us. Ada, aku akan cikin bandar mu, aku mabih ada ni de bandar bandar bang. Agan de mu mungkin nuk nuna muka kau nada darah jawa, de mu de mu tun tawa, muk 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 eating kahoh dekai. Amma dega suca mawal dekiba muslim ebane. Suka ma suka ni abengga jaya ya de mu ma garin cewa su sun film mu mu tun taka, de eating kahoh dekai kan cewa kene ubana kasaga baki dah. So it was when I was at war on the funeral of the wife of my senior, fa senior brother who has also passed on. Mm. It was there that the vice president sent a delegation to commiserate with us at war, mm. led uh, and Dr. Uthman uh, mm. yeah, yeah. was in the company of the delegation. Yeah. And there he announced to the large crowd that was there to receive them, he announced to us the sad news of the demise of our father. Uh, well, of our mother. Yeah, look at the Jadi nawa, anda muka muka rasa waktu matang babanya yayana, to vice president ya ikut tawaga zus tayamu makoki jago ranching si dan nak doktor Olman, alok kacin ni jadi doktor Olman ya senar, cikin waktu babang taro da angkai, kama kai maga abenda ya samika alok kacin kita muka samula bari. On return, it was 
in the month of Ramadan, the A2 was to follow. So we felt it more appropriate to let all these things pass before we come to hold the hands of uh, our father, to commiserate with him. And this time, instead of he advising us also to give him his children a collective piece of advice. <laughs> So by a hakan and look at the same Samozomaka, the Desierta, look at the Munzo, Kayumaka, Bamo, Naka Irin Nasiha, uh, one day Kamata. He has been giving us pieces of advice from time to time, not just we Muslims, but the whole of Ghana. Look at the Bandabamal and Kanabamu Nasiha, Kana Guts Raman and Nasiha, and the Bandabandabang, Bagamu Muslim Kataba, and Maga Majama Ganagabaki there. But at this point in time, it's now our duty to humbly appeal to him and pray that Allah Ta'ala may grant him the patience, mm. the patience that is needed to, for one to be able to <clears throat> absorb whatever shocks that uh, we may witness in from this sad event, which is the passing on of our mother. We, we also advise and pray at the same time that Almighty Allah may grant him the fortitude, the fortitude to be able to withstand this serious, serious shock that uh, we have received. As far as we are concerned, it is our mother who is gone. But luckily, our father is still with us. And we are, gratitude, we are grateful to the Almighty Allah for that favor. We know that it is within the means, the power of the Almighty Allah, to take both of them away. But Allah uh, decided to have mercy upon us because they had to go. So He decided to take our mother first and to allow our father to be there with us still so that we can continue benefiting from Him. It is therefore the time for all of us, including our father, to let this sad news, to put it aside to rest, so that we continue with our lives. But of course, while we continue with our lives, for us to continue remembering her in our prayers, from time to time, mm. that Allah may grant her Jannatul Firdaus. Amen. Can I tell you that when one year goes by, Ru, say Mubarshi, Moi, Mo Ajeshi, can Abenda Allah, the Kawoke, Nam, can Iko, Iko, Allah, ne. So now, come Modu, Modu, Banang, Gaba, the Abenda, Abenda, Yesaura, the Kawunchi, wa Allah, ya Bata Rahma, the Jink, Ayi, Kuma, Yesata, Jannatul Firdaus. A mother who passes on at a time when it is not just a household that you have as your family, not just a district that you have as your family and not just a region that you have as your family but at a time when the whole nation of Ghana you have them as your family you have brought them up and we are mature enough if our mother passes on this time we only say that locally that she has gone home mm. that is not what we call death mm. So for as long as our Creator, our Lord, the Almighty Allah is alive, we believe that he will continue to protect our father. We believe that he will continue to give him that peace of mind, that contentment of heart. And we believe that he will continue to guide him 
and we believe that he will continue to give him the strength, energy, and the wisdom with which he will continue to take care of the rest of us who are still alive and with him. It is been the prayer of each and every one of us that Allah enable us to emulate his example in various numerous ways. There are examples that are shining examples and we need to imbue in ourselves those examples. If we succeed to do that, we would have been lucky, as lucky as he is. Not as much as he. I don't think any one of us can get to his stage anymore, but we would have sufficiently benefited from his charisma. In the form of reiteration, I would want to reaffirm the fact that as far as we the Ahmadi Muslims in this country are concerned, we accept him wholeheartedly, we are with him wholeheartedly, and uh, we want to assure him that we are always available at any given time he wants us. Daytime, nighttime, whatever time he wants any one of us, he will get us. Whatever he wants from us, he will always get it. So we should rest assured that if he has no children anywhere, but we are definitely his children. We'll continue to pray for you, but we need your prayers even more. And uh, it is our prayer that Allah may continue to grant him longer life, but a healthy one, so that uh, he, can, he can continue enjoying the paternal, the filial love that he has given us. Allah, we, we know that it's a matter of time. Allah has a time limit that he has placed there for him. So uh, that one day he will depart just as our mother has departed. Our humble prayer on this occasion of the demise of our mother our humble request to our father, therefore, is that he humbly, we humbly request him to continue to pray for us that even after him, even after him, mm. Allah may grant us a befitting replacement who can take care of us in a fatherly manner as he has been doing now. <laughs> So this is what has brought us here today. We to commiserate, to identify with him, to let him understand and know that yes, we've lost our mother, but we are there. Inshallah. What you have done is in accordance with the Sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Alaihi Wasallam. This kind of uh, coming to commiserate and sympathize is the Sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. 
Um, the one who comes to express the condolence and the one on who, in whose interest the condolence is being expressed, both categories will not remain in the world permanently. Even when we live, however long we live, there must come a time when we will depart. Therefore, I'm grateful to you. I'm grateful to you. May Allah give you the reward for this kind of gesture. And may Allah strengthen the bond of relationship between us. All of us, may Allah grant us the blessings of our patience. Now, and our, our country, Ghana, may Allah order our affairs for us. All these things we are having, this kind of uh, very good relationship and event that we are having, is because there is, there is peace. It is because of there is harmony and peace. That's why you even have the opportunity to pay this courtesy call. Therefore, may Allah increase and enhance our, our harmony. All of our departed souls, now those that we can remember, those we cannot remember, may Allah grant them his mercy. Amen. And may Allah help us, uh, make us live this world in the best manner. May Allah strengthen and deepen the bond of our relationship. Fatiha. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. Ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Maliki yawm al-Din. Iyaka na'abud wa iyaka nasta'in. إهدنا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين أنعمت عليهم غير المكذوب عليهم ولا الضالين آمين. Good. Uh, on my own behalf, Amir <coughs> and the entire delegation, uh, I want to express my profound thanks and appreciation uh, for this show and demonstration of love, uh, sympathy, reverence, and uh, respect. And also to thank you also for coming to share with the Chief Imam. Um, the joy of the occasion in which we are, and that is the, the Eid al-Fitr festivity. Um, as we have said, we will only uh, give you the information with respect to the arrangement for our funeral, according to our tradition. Um, apart from the burial, we also have organized the third day dua. Um, so we have, the decision has been taken with the approval of the chief imam that we will do the 40th day dua on the 5th of May, May 5, uh, inshallah. And uh, as the time draws close, I'm sure we will also uh, let, let you know. Uh, and the venue will still be at Fadama here on the, on the park. Uh, that's where the funeral will, will be organized. Uh, and so on this note, once again, we are grateful to you. And we pray that Allah will reward you uh, for the kindness that you have expressed to the chief imam. Pray Allah grant us life and good health for us to see the day when we shall all, uh, you and us, uh, come behind our father and make him do the final adua for, for his uh, second spouse. Uh, thank you so much. Oh, okay. I think there's. Uh